Hello again and welcome back. I've got uh, a little bit of a haul for you today. Uh, I've got Michael's stuff and Dollar Tree stuff. This is all not uh, from one day. It's from a few trips over the course of a few weeks. So I didn't spend this much all at the same time. So I'll go ahead and start with um, Michael's and then we'll move on to Dollar Tree. So let me just move this all off to the side. Um, I know everybody's seen these already. I got these two so far. Um, I don't know if I'm going to get them all because I didn't really care for the holiday book. So um, I don't think I'll be getting that one or the fitness one or the budgeting one since I already got the Recollections uh, bigger $14.99 book. But I did get the planning is my hobby. And I believe you do get two sheets of each. Let's see. So you got some um, bill dues and paydays, which is great. Smaller ones. You have some meeting, some blank ones, some gold foiling going on in here as well. Looks like uh, date time place. Let's get two of those. You get some banners, blanks, and important remember, some more blank, uh, maybe appointment boxes, some small little remembers, and I like all the colors in these too. I like this because I know that there's a, a recollections like um, sticker thing like this that comes with these, and I almost got that one, but I'm glad I didn't because I got these in here. So you got some laundry, some cleaning, groceries, looks like doctor's appointments mail, phone call, and then again. So again, two of that one. Then this is what I was really happy about because um, if you watched one of my previous videos where I said um, the Mambi books don't bring things like vacuum and clean bathroom, and I wish they did, this one does. So I was very happy to see that when I was at Michael's flipping through these. So I got, I can use a lot of those. Then you have this week fitness, meals, and notes, which is great. This is one giant sticker. You can also cut it down if you want to. Then you've got some uh, to-dos and some blank to-dos, so you can label it whatever you want. Some decorative stickers, which I think is great. These are kind of like three parts. Um, the blue box is one part, the white box is another part, and then the Hustle Hard Girl is another part. So it's like three in one, but I'm just gonna probably put them all together to make one sticker. And you got some corners. Then you've also got some uh, small three heart checklists. You've got some circle ones. Um, this could be anything you want it to be. I'll probably use these for meals for the week and some more checklists. Again, a lot of gold foiling. And then you've got your fitness. This is another reason why I didn't get the fitness book because you do get a few pages with uh, water intake, workout stickers, core, leg day, arm day, goal reached, cardio, steps, calories. And then uh, the last couple, oh no, there's a few more. <laughs> then you've got some dots and some banners and flags. And then I think, yeah, this is the last couple pages. You do get some uh, letters and some gold foiled letters as well. Except I wish they would have been um, like maybe the A's and B's would have been gold foils here. Because then you all, well, I mean, it works either way. So I'm really happy I got that one. These are normally $9.99. They were 40% off. And also got the I've Got Big Plans. So you've got me time, time to travel, buy, mail, pay, order, make. Some boxes to write whatever you want here. So you got spa day, haircut, girl time, donut date, coffee date, some more blank appointment ones, lazy day. Again, some more uh, fitness, which is fine. I'll still use it. I like because these have cheat days as well. Let me make sure I'm not skipping any. Okay. Some more flags, some wedding, appointments, busy, fun day. Got um, it's really pretty. I don't know what to call this, but these are really nice. Girls night out. Happy hour, karaoke, dancing. 
So you've got some more blank to-dos. You can label it whatever you want. Some birthdays, which is uh, the reason why I didn't get the holiday one is because I didn't like most of the holidays in there and I didn't like the birthday stickers in there, but I liked these. Then you've got some vacation ones, which I think they also have a travel one for this, but my Michaels didn't have it yet, I don't think. These are sticking together. You've got some weekend banners, some blank boxes, some more dots. You've got a shopping list and then a blank one as well. Some more heart checklists and uh, dot checklists. And then you've got some either you could use for washi or banners or whatever you want. And then again, you've got some more letters. So I was really happy with these when my Michaels finally got them in because they, they're slowly getting stuff in from the new line. And then you saw this really quick earlier. These are inspiration stickers and um, like scratch off stickers. So uh, you could write your bill here and how much and when you pay it, you could scratch it off. You can also scratch it off when you do your um, whatever to-do lists or anything you're using this checklists for. You've also got some daily inspiration, so you do have seven. You can scratch one off each day, your hydrate. So I thought this was really cool. Just a really fun thing to add into my planner. I don't remember how, how much these are, I'm sorry. I threw away the receipt already. And then I thought these were really pretty. You have some blank banners, vacation and weekend banners, and it's 65 pieces. And it's just the same. So I thought these would be really nice, even though I already have a lot of weekend banners from kits and other things. I just thought these were really pretty as well. I also got um, a, the Tombow dual brush pens for the portrait palette. Um, I did get the Hoo Hoo Hero, I don't know how you pronounce that, um, markers off of Amazon. This is an 80 set. It was like 40 bucks. And you do get quite a bit. You get a lot of grays and things like that. Um, it didn't have a lot of um, skin tones, so that's why I decided to get this one. Um, I was testing them out the other day and they're not working really well with the paper that I have, so I will have to buy like some watercolor paper because these are water-based and then these are alcohol-based. But I like the colors in here. Hopefully I can uh, use them because, or learn to use them, I mean, because I was trying it and it was coming out really, really streaky. So I'll have to practice with these. Next, I also got um, a traveler's notebook. Um, I was wanting one a little bit bigger than a personal size. I still don't know how much I'm going to use it, but I have started using it. So this is from the Dollar Tree from a while back. It's just one of those zipper um, fabric pouches with the um, elastic band that you can stick around your planner and it fits just fine. I tried putting it on the outside and it kind of bent the cover in which wouldn't damage the cover itself, but I just didn't like the way it looked. But the inside, like hard cardboard, um, whatever that you call this, um, is just big enough that it doesn't bend it. So that works. And then I did get uh, three of the notebooks for here. So I'm using this one to journal. And then, so this is just the plain, no lines or anything. Um, this one is the grid. And then this one is the dotted grid. So I, again, I don't know exactly how many use them yet, but I will use it. And then I did stick this um, tiny uh, blank notebook from Michaels. I think it was from like the $1.50 bins. So I got those while they were on sale. I think it was like half off. So I know the notebooks are usually like 10 and I think this is normally like $14.99. And then the last thing I found a few, like about a week or two ago, was the zippered planners that are on clearance. Um, the dated ones are on clearance. At least some of them were. Uh, and then uh, obviously the non-dated ones they can just keep selling. So they weren't on sale, unfortunately, because I really wanted the little dog, the blue one with the little dog. But um, they had this one on clearance and they had the llama one that says 2017 and I really like that one too. But I decided to go ahead and go with this one. So what I'm gonna do with this one is I'm gonna do what I've seen a lot of people doing, which is turn it into a wallet. So I can have um, 
grocery lists in here, to-do lists, errands, uh, things like that, and then coupons. So let me go off frame real quick because I forgot I have something in here that's personal. <laughs> so um, this is one of those baseball like um, collector's baseball things you could just stick in there. And I think I got these from Dollar Tree a long time ago, so just cut off the top. And then I took my little X-Acto knife and I just made little X cuts so that the rings would fit through. So I can put my credit cards in here, coupons, things like that. And then I do have um, the remaining months of the year. And I have started uh, planning in June, but I'm not gonna show you because I don't really like how it came out because I'm not used to the little amount of space you have. So I'm still um, trying to figure out the style that I want to use in the personal planner. So I've got one of my Dollar Tree pens in here. And then my phone can also fit in here and my little slip wallet if I need to. And then I can take this with me to the store. So I thought that was really great and these were on plans for like $5.99. So that's my Michaels haul for Dollar Tree. I've been seeing people haul these little guys for a few weeks and I was on the lookout um, because I just thought they were really cute and I don't know if I'm going to keep all of them yet or not but um, I thought they'd be really cute decoration for my desk so I just I really like the colors I think they're adorable so I finally found them I haven't found the cats yet from um, I think it's a monster high cats I haven't found them yet I only want one of those though like I don't want all three of those and then I have been buying little by little the satin ribbon because I'm practicing on making um, clips uh, for my planner so like uh, bows and things so I did get this is the gross grain ribbon in black I got satin in silver and then I picked up today the scalloped edge ribbon and this pretty like peachy pink. I don't have um, a planner like paper clip to show you with those because I think I, I'm going to send them off to someone and they're already packed up. I also got this washi tape today. I thought that was really pretty. So I only got that one. They did have a bunch of other different ones but I didn't really like all of those. And then I also picked up one of these photo albums. You can remove these covers, which I think is great. You can remove that. I'm probably gonna like make a little cover to stick in there for my stickers because this is uh, gonna be smaller sticker storage, which I don't have any on hand right now to show you that are this size. But which way do you load? I think it's top, it's side loading, which is good. It might be a little bit annoying if the sticker page is like almost too big for this, but um, I just thought that might be a good way to store some of my stickers. And then the last couple things I found today were these cuties. So these I got mostly for the bottom ones, which I hope are a lot more than uh, it looks like. And I might keep some of the squares and rounded ones but I'll go ahead and open them up so you guys can see um, I didn't open these yet as you can tell there's still tape holding them closed so the first ones are these really cute I think I will keep these these are adorable it's got this little plastic thing holding it closed it's just one large sheet and it's all just the same things so I can use the little sneakers for like workout days these little guys for like notes or ideas or things. The glasses one, creative nerd, that's cute. So I'll definitely keep these. Then you also get a pretty big sheet of these as well. So I thought the dogs with the sunglasses were adorable. And I like the little the girls too, so I might use those as well. I get quite a bit in here for a dollar so that's not bad and then you get where is your aha uh -huh. and you get a big roll oh you get wow okay oh these are so cute okay so you get some 
cell phones with glasses, beakers with glasses, or flasks, whatever these are called. Little piggies, cupcakes, and then it just repeats. Those are cute, I'll definitely use those. And then you've got some more of the girls and the dogs with the glasses. So I will probably just keep all of these, they're great. They're so cute. And then this one, what attracted me the most was the little lamb. So let's see what's in here. Okay, so the first roll, we've got some animals. Looks like either horses, looks like horses, zebras, little foxes, bears, elephants. I might send these off to um, a friend. And then these are so cute. Yes, this is adorable. Okay, so you've got two rolls here again. These are so cute. Look at the little octopus with the baby one. The camera's not wanting to focus, sorry. And you got a panda and a whale, a koala. Is that a hedgehog or a porcupine? I think it's a hedgehog. Little narwhal. These are cute. This will be fun to use. And then you've got some more animal faces. That's a little creepy, that one right there. <laughs> so I might send those off to my friend as well. And then let's see, oh, I can already tell these are great. Oh, look at the little pony, the little unicorn. I think this was, I think they had one more box. I'm a little sad I didn't get the other box now. Look how cute these are. Oh, these are adorable. Yeah, I'm sad I didn't get the other box now. <laughs> but I will definitely be using a lot of these. All right, so that is my haul for today. If you are not yet a subscriber, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button so you don't miss future videos. And I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Bye.